and DoorDash just delivered my lunch. Most everybody on YouTube knows this cat, Mr. Beast. Country is in an uproar over these hamburgers and I ordered me one, so let's try it out. Comes nicely packaged. Here are the French fries, the seasoned fries, and here is the burger. Try one of these. Comes with a can of Pepsi. It's not cold, but that's all right. We can put ice on it. And some fry sauce. Try another one of these. These fries are good. Run of the mill fries, but they put some seasoning on there that are out of this world, man. Pretty dang gum good. Without further ado, let's get into this thing and just see what this is all about. Kind of excited about this. Packaged nice. Let's get it all undone. Impressions, a little bit smashed, but that's all right. It all makes a turd, doesn't it? We've got a couple pickles, mayonnaise, the two hamburger patties, cheese, and bacon, and more cheese. Let's go in for the kill. The bun's not like it shows on the uh, the website or other videos that I've seen on uh, uh, YouTube. This looks like just a run-of-the-mill hamburger bun. Uh, the other buns that I've seen are that big, thick, roll-style buns. But from what I understand, let's go ahead and take a bite. Not bad. Nicely cooked, not overdone, and not too raw. They didn't have any offering for jalapenos or anything on the app, but it definitely needs some pickled jalapenos on that sucker. Let's try another french fry in their fry sauce. I think it's just ketchup. Pretty good, pretty good. Of course, this is a delivery only restaurant and this hamburger traveled about 15 20 minutes before it got to me so it's a little bit cool but it's all good and from what i understand <clears throat> how these restaurants are just popping up everywhere where he's able to just make 300 restaurants in three weeks is astonishing so what i've the, the research that i've done is that he ghosts his restaurant or his cooks in other restaurants and the quality, as you can tell, is pretty good. The bun, like I said before, is not quite the same as it is in the pictures. He may, this, this hamburger may have come out of a Chinese restaurant. I don't know, I don't care, as long as it's good. Not bad, Mr. Beast, not bad, sir. Mr. Beast sauce kind of has that horseradishy taste, which I love, especially when it comes to like Arby's. I love a uh, horsey sauce from Arby's. But anyway, guys, if you like this content, give me a thumbs up and give me a <clears throat> smash that like button and subscribe. And while you're there, click the bell so you get all my new videos. We'll see you on the next one.